What brought me back from London was the concern that I had when I started receiving reports about the unrest that was uh, unfolding here, the burning and torching of buildings, the looting that had started happening here, and the protests that were underway. And as I looked at all this and received reports, I felt that we needed to have an immediate, an immediate presence here. As that's why the Deputy President, myself, Secretary General, and the Deputy Secretary General, and other members of the National Executive Committee of the ANC came out here. And we've been given a full briefing about some of the challenges, the problems, and the issues that are unfolding here and are at stake. Having listened to all the inputs, we have decided that we would like to engage further with a number of other people, particularly members of the community here, not only in Mahike, but also in the Northwest, the issues that are being raised have to do with the position of the Premier, they have to do with governance, they have to do with issues of corruption in the province, and we've decided that these are matters that are serious enough as to enable us <coughs> to discuss the matters broadly with people as quickly as possible on an urgent basis and ensure that we are able to get all the information which will then empower us to then take a decision going forward. Now this is the way we work. We want to base our decisions on evidence, on proper analysis, on proper evaluation, so that when we come to a decision, we have looked at everything that has to do with all the issues, looked at it from all sides, and then be able to take a decision. Now, there may be a concern out there that we are going to take forever. I want to assure everyone that we are going to act speedily on this matter. We are not able to give the exact time frame now, but we are going to act as speedily as possible to address each of the issues that have been raised with us. Now, we would like to make a call to all the citizens of Mahikeng, all the citizens of the Northwest, and indeed all our people, to remain calm, to not get into anything that will lead to unrest, protests that can lead to violence, that can lead to destruction of property, be it government property or private property, and we call on all our people that let's be calm and this matter is going to be resolved. It is only when we are calm and we discuss matters in an orderly matter, in manner and we deal with them in that way that we are able to find sustainable and durable solutions. Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 Thank you.